hate speech, fake news, votes and PVC buying are issues that take center stage at this workshop as media practitioners are advised to stay clear of issues that may dent the sustainability of democracy in Nigeria, as well as resulting in electoral violence. To help Nigerians make sense of political activities, media coverage should be devoid of sentiments so as not to stir crisis in the country before, during and after the electionary period. This is according to the Nigerian Broadcasting Commission and other stakeholders in the media. As well as various platforms of engagement to offer the best ambience for the Nigerian broadcasting industry to positively impact upon the Nigerian political and electoral processes. We will also not relent in our efforts to read our electoral processes of votes and PVC by. I want to say that selling your vote, sorry, your PVC or your vote, it is like selling your destiny. Media has been advised to be wary of unverified news. The media is expected to enhance the unity of the nation through objective analysis of events as the success of any electoral process could be marred by hate speech. Nigeria's most valuable asset remains peaceful, credible and transparent government that Nigerians deserve. That Nigeria occupies a strategic position in West Africa, the African continent, and indeed globally. It is therefore crucial that Nigeria delivers credible, peaceful, and fair elections in 2019 in a manner that improves upon the performance of the 2015 elections. The United Nations observed that women and youth who constitute a larger population of voter register are not given the chance to participate in the electoral process. As such, all aspirants should be given a level playing field. Stakeholders advocate that issues that may clearly jeopardize the peace and security of Nigerians must be clearly avoided to ensure a free, fair and credible elections. In Abuja, Oluwato Bienito, reporting for Roots TV, Nigeria.